Welcome to the following presentation of the Dozen Trivia by Barstool Sports. Is Carl. it Crime Dog, Fred and Griffin? Jesus, how in the hell? The winners of the Dozen yes. are turning into big screaming hoggers. Yeah, boys! Yeah, boys! Yeah, the movie's called Get <laughs> Ponies pulling up. All right, it's a dozen match. 33 of season four of the dozen match. 369 overall. A brand new week of, of matches. Some great matches this week. We had a four match week last week. Uh, this week, you got. A top 10 matchup, 8 versus 9, Smokin taking on the Booze Ponies. We also have, I think, uh, Gaza Soldiers, Uptown Balls, um, Experts, I believe, playing Flux, and then uh, Frank Getz, Honkers as well. So great week ahead. Uh, two top 10 teams, two teams with strong fan votes, strong bases, looking at that tournament in June, but er, still third way through the season, uh, presented by New Amsterdam Vodka, sponsoring the bonus round and the double sip. I will start with the Ponies, who had a tough loss, 2-2-0, uh, two, two and oh, ranked number nine, Smokin' 1-1-1. One, one, and one. The, That is the class. Smokin's trademarked that record, 1-1-1. One, one, and one. Uh, yep. Last time, though, Ponies, uh, tough loss at the end there uh, to Chicago. Yeah, I, I was thinking 20 early in the match. I was like, we're going to fuck it. I think we were up 7-3, something like that, 8-3, like crazy nine, early, 9-3. Nine, nine, three. And I, I was like, we're going to score 20 on their head. Yeah, did not miss one question in the first half. <laughs> yeah. uh, sold two. Yeah, then the wheels kind of. We are solid. better than 500. That's, a fact. That's for sure. That's for sure. Jeff, where would you say the ponies are ranked on the fan vote? Uh, ponies are a consistent top four, top five fan vote. Uh, sometimes as high as two, depending on the week. It, it fluctuates when you play. Um, but we're so not pretty high we're fan not, vote. We're not playing at the Super Bowl, correct? No, you're not. No. Mm. That's interesting. That's two teams. <laughs> yeah, that's that. <laughs> right. Two teams now take issue with that. Um, <laughs> tickets for the dozen in Las Vegas. Uh, the Sin City Showdown, uh, which will be on February 8th at 6 p.m., uh, featuring the Frankettes. They'll be taking on the experts. ZD and the Yak winners take on each other in the championship. It's our third event uh, from the big game. All West Coast, so Hollywood. Uh, then we were in uh, last year in Scottsdale, Phoenix area, Glendale. And now in Las Vegas on the strip from HyperX Arena at the Luxor Hotel and Casino. Please know it's our smallest venue we've done this in, actually since Hollywood. So it's not a lot of tickets, only a couple hundred tickets. Probably going to go pretty fast. Tickets on sale the 23rd of January, Tuesday, the 23rd of January. Tickets are going on sale. We will hold back a select amount of tickets. So if you're a fan of uh, the Chiefs, the Ravens, the Niners, the Lions, and you decide to go to the Super Bowl after they win the conference championship game and you want to go to the Dozen that Thursday night, February 8th at 6 p.m., you can do so. So we are going to set a select number of tickets available for that next Monday, uh, which will be uh, January 29th. Uh, tickets, though, will be going on sale soon. Act now. We cannot wait to see you there if you decide to attend. Hey, but you and Fights are hosting the intermission show. Oh, I'm very yeah. excited. It, yeah, well, we we gotta. You can't say stuff like that until we talk to Dana about this. We gotta sit him down and and let him know that this is hey, this is the first I'm hearing, and that's okay. I get it. I don't. I don't. I mean, if are, if you're there, you'll host it as well. I don't. I'm not invited. I'm not important enough. Okay. Um. I hate that you had to find out like this, Dana. <laughs> <laughs> tickets. Right. I don't. You didn't, show, right. you didn't show up to the last intermission show, Billy. Billy C. So. <laughs> right. Uh, well, I I did wear his jersey in honor, though, so he was there yeah. in spirit. Um, Smokin, Titus, Ken, Jack, Mincy picked up that win last week. Uh, or last time you did. played, evened up. Have Have you broken the the close loss streak? The curse. Uh, I think I we'll find so, out tonight, right? Jeff. I think I think we got two teams that love to shoot themselves in the foot. Um, so we'll uh, we'll see who shoots themselves better, or <laughs> in the, or, or I don't Hot know. Start. 
fall to, fall apart a little bit, there, Jeff. But uh, that's a great let's, let's, that let's, represents these two teams. <laughs> let's beat a dead horse. How about that, Titus? We'll, yeah. Let's beat a dead horse, literally, um, with the ponies. Smocking against the ponies. It is truly a, two teams that play in almost routinely close matches, though. I, I, I get. Yeah, I, I think Je- Jeff. What are the odds this goes to overtime? Like just two to one. I mean, with, it's, it's, it's. I feel like it's, it's like, like a thirty-three percent chance every smocking match goes to overtime. Yeah. That's that's really what it is. Like. They, they've gone the last two seasons. They've gone to overtime in I think thirty three percent of their matches. Um, so <laughs> here we go, Smokin against the Boost Ponies. Great matchup here. Two teams that are, are primed for the tournament later on in the season. Um, twenty four questions, twelve rounds of trivia. Twenty fifth being the bonus round. Uh, two li- uh, two lifelines that you can use together. The double sip presented by Nam Vodka. You can answer a question twice, and your call a friend. You can pair those up. You can't use those on anything that you use the third lifeline on, which would be the double up, double play category. You want make it worth two points. Mm-hmm. Cannot use a lifeline there, and you can't double up round ten. That's in each category round. That's already worth two points. Uh, here we go. Smocking coming off that win against Gen X Y Z. Close loss for uh, the Ponies in their last match. Smokin, uh, I think the record is they're now they're one five and three all uh, in the last two seasons in matches decided by two points or less. It's unbelievable. Here we go. First category. Smokin, you're up second every time. Boost points, you're up first. Uh, Compton and Titus, final answer, people. Uh, NBA first category. NBA. Here we go. In 2004, Denver executed a six-year, $82 million sign-and-trade deal for this one-time all-star power forward from the East with playoff experience. 35 Wait. seconds are on the No, course. Mincy, Mincy, it's not us. It's not no. us. No. I was going to ask, was this for us? That's no. Us. I wasn't gonna... Okay. <laughs> Close one. That's called the Mincy. He almost pulled yeah. the Mincy. <laughs> hmm. 2004. This is like a little bit before I started paying attention. Ten seconds. Five. Four. The only person that's popped my head is Nene. Two. That's not it. Who? One. Nene. Final answer, Nene. Is it Kenyon Martin? I think think it's Al Harrington, maybe. Oh, Al Harrington. fuck. Yeah. But do you want to double sip? We could we could double sip. Say, I, 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 we could double sip it though because Denver did get Kenyon Martin. Can't on a steal. That, so I wouldn't hate if we, we can't on a steal. We can't. We can't on a steal. We can't oh, double okay. sip. Okay. What do you? Okay. Your your call, Titus. It's one of the other. Uh, uh, was Antoine Jameson two. also? We'll trust. What? We'll trust Mincy. Al Harrington. Final answer. It was Kenny. Let's go. Damn it. Let's go. Screwed us. Sorry, Titus. It was Kmart. Yeah, I should have known that. Fuck me. Here we go. Other side to make it one to nothing. This 2005 Wizards trade sent Kwame Brown out west in exchange. This small forward got a five-year extension and became a two-time All-Star in Washington. 2005 Wizards trade sent Kwame Brown out west um, in exchange this small forward. What small forward became a two-time All-Star in Washington? Uh, Fuck. Fucking small forward played in. That was good. Pre wall. I, I mean, is Larry Hughes maybe? Three. Two. Yeah, sure. Larry Hughes, final answer. No I idea. think Ken Jack said it in the last round. I think it's Antoine Jameson. I think. Give it a go. You just want me to do it? Yeah. Antoine Jameson, final answer. Karan Butler. Ah, Brandon, God. shut the fuck up. Good Brandon. questions, Jeff. Good questions. <laughs> Dude, I, I didn't realize how stressful going first is because then you're just rooting against them for like three questions in a row. Yeah. It's very yeah. difficult. What's what's Brandon all mad about? Uh, Brandon's playing, by the way, Brandon's playing Tiger Woods over my shoulder, Tiger Woods 2005, <laughs> and uh, he waits till we're both wrong and he hears the buzzer and then he whispers the answer. <laughs> That's not annoying. <laughs> uh, celebrity mashup. Do you want to double anybody? I uh, want to wait for music, boys. Uh, whatever y'all think. Okay. Uh, you guys are a music crew, huh? I wouldn't have guessed that. They are. These, yeah, these two are doubling. They're they're eight and four in music, but they started doubling. But they've also double mashup. They 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 kind of double. What do you what do you think? What do you think, Ken Jack? I, I think if we have music, music, it'd be better to wait for music. All right, we'll wait. Really we'll wait, that. Jeff. We're not doubling. Uh, you guys are go. so good it's at music. For the booze ponies to make it one nothing. Two celebrities. 
Oof. Oh, easy. I got, the, I got both. It's Jeff Garland and yeah. Kendall Roy. I don't know his real name. Oh, fuck. You shouldn't have said that, huh? <laughs> no. Jeremy Strong. Bang. All right. Is Jeff Garland his name in the show or in? No, it's his real life name. All right. So think, what are they? Right? Jeff Garland and Jeremy Strong. Yeah. And Jeremy Strong. Final answer. That is correct. Jeff. Hey, good pool Jeff- fights. <laughs> Garland or Garland? Garland. Because Garland. Garland. he put a D on that. Willie no, C no, put a D on that. No, I didn't. It's G-A-R-L-I. No, as Willie long as C. it doesn't matter. It w- it, Dana said Garland. He could have said some g- grieve win. I don't know. He could say, he, they said it right. Somebody said it right. It's all that matters. Here we go. Other side to make it one-to-one. That's John Lovitz and Billy Crudup. <laughs> yeah. That's a that's a interesting kind of good looking guy. I guess that yeah. helps. Half his face is Billy Crudup. Weird looking cat. <laughs> yeah, you're 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 certain, right, that's, Kendrick? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah, uh, it's yeah. Je- right. Jeff loves the morning show. That's the morning show. Uh, you're like one of the two people that watch that show, and I know you're a Billy Crudup guy. All so. right. Uh, final answer, Jeff. That is correct. Billy Crudup, John Lovitz. I think that's John Lovitz's debut in the Celebrity Mashup. Congrats to John Lovitz. Nice. Hell yeah. The, I'm going to be honest. The combo looks better than each of them individually. In that, in, <laughs> in, in, <laughs> Billy Crudup is handsomer, but that picture in particular, yeah. no. <laughs> um, NFL next category, NFL. This is for the ponies. It's one-to-one. One-to-one, no lifelines used yet. This NFC team had one one in conference championship games from 2000 through 2009, including a 34-14 loss to the Seahawks. Could that be the Saints? Oh, it's, 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 it's either Saints or Vinci. Saints or Packers, Vinci. right? Vinci. The conference championship. Vinci. We're not up. <laughs> oh. Vinci, I said that. I'm not on your team. <laughs> Uh, it's it's either the Packers lost the Seahawks too, right? So it's one of the two. I'm just thinking of the the. Where did the Packers win? That was against the Saints. Oh yes, yes. No, uh, but they didn't go to the Super Bowl <laughs> that year. Five, four. Which one you like? Three. Packers. 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 Final answer. Other side. Fuck. Okay, Vincey, now talk. All right, so the. The, the Saints lost to the Seahawks was was in 2010 because uh, that was the year after the 09 Super Bowl. So the Saints did go one on one in conference championships though from 2000 2009 because they beat the Vikings and they lost to the Bears. Five. What team so, did the Saints beat not in Saints? the Super Bowl? I mean, I don't know, but they did go one and one. And I, one Cowboys. Arizona Cardinals. Final answer. It's the Panthers. Panthers. Okay. Oh. Dude, I, I given, also – I would not have given the Saints with Mincy in the game. Just, I couldn't believe Mincy answered me as if I'm on his team. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> the the Packers also <laughs> won that game. I'm thinking of when Tim Hasselbeck was like, we want the ball, we're going to score or whatever. Yeah, so. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This AFC team went one and one in conference championship games from 2000 to 2009, including a 16-3 loss to the Ravens. This is smocking. Okay. Um, AFC team one and one in conference championship games. Um, sixteen three loss to the Ravens. That had to be the year two thousand when the Ra- I had no idea. I was like, was like six years old. Um, 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 who was good? The the Titans, the Titans, they, the Titans made the Super Bowl, right? The year wow. after. Yeah, I kind of like that. Three. Yeah, Titans, final answer. Uh, Broncos, maybe? I mean, did they, they went to a Super Bowl. Right? Broncos would be good. I, I also have an Im- image of Mark Brunel and the Jaguars, Raiders? but the I'm going to go. I've been 0 for so. Yeah, but the Jaguars, I don't think they didn't go to the Super Bowl, right? Did the Raiders no. go? No. Oh, well, yeah. Five. Ra- 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 the four. Four. Raiders Three. went. Two. Right. Raiders. One. Raiders, final answer. That's correct. Two to one. Hey, good shit, Dana. Good shit. Because they went to the Super Bowl. They went to the Super Bowl in like 02, right? Rich Gannon, 03? baby. 03? Yeah. yeah. Next category, music. Ponies. Double. Two to one. Doubled up for smocking. Double. Doubled up for smocking. We got we to gotta remember we have our lifelines, boys. We got to remember that. Yeah. This is for the ponies. Yes, yeah, this that would help. This is for the ponies.
finished the lyrics of this 2003 song. 2003 song. Here it is. Not us, Mincy. What you're expecting of me, but under the pressure of walking in your walking in your shoes. It's walking in your shoes, right? Yeah. Yeah, walking yeah. in your shoes. In your Final shoes. answer. That is correct. Three Let's to go. One. To tie it up. Great song. Great. Dude, I've been listening to a good event on Lincoln Park lately. I don't know why. 2008. That works out then for you. 2008 <laughs> song. 2008 song. Sound like you don't know me. You got a new friend. Well, I got homies. But in the end. Still the old me. Something, something, the old me. Can we hear it one more time, please, Jeff? Yep. You can hear it four times. Mm hmm. Like you don't know me, you got a new friend. Well, I got homies, but in the end, in the end, you know, it's still the old me or something. It's st- but in the it's end, you know, it's still the old me. It's still the old me. Yeah. You hear it one more time, Jeff. Oh, yeah, you hear it two more times. Oh, fuck. Like you don't know me, you got a new friend. Well, I got homies, but in the end. 13 seconds. But in the end, what do we think? Anybody? Uh, I think I think let's hear it one more time for the road, Jeff. <laughs> uh, you can do that. And then a five-second <laughs> countdown when it's over. You get five seconds when it's over. Like you don't know me, you got a new friend. Well, I got homies, but in the end. Five, four, three. It's still the same old me. Final answer. But in um, the end, I'm still so lonely. Say it again, Will. Say, say it again, uh, fights. But in, in the, the end, end I'm, I'm still, still so lonely. I'm still so lonely. Final answer. No! But in the end, it's still the old me. Is that it? It's still yeah. so lonely. It's still oh, so lonely. Oh, so man. man. The Bullet fuck? dodge what by I say, I'm still so lonely. Yeah. Ooh, Damn, geez. dude. I thought for sure that was it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. I'm Big still, moment. It's um. It's oh. <sighs> hey, we dodged their double. Let's. Yeah. Uh, I thought we were gonna get it. That's That's good optimism <laughs> right there, Dana. Yep. Yep. Come on, boys. <laughs> College hoops next category. Oh, we shouldn't double because they got Titus on the other end. So let's not do that. Smart. Smart. Thank you with the brain, the Dana. Smart. For the ponies to make it four to one. Does I really matter? want to, though. Following Jimmy Butler's departure, this Marquette forward had a big senior year, averaging over 17 points per game, eight rebounds per game, was the 2012 Big East Player of the Year. That should be Jay Crowder if I'm not overthinking it. But give me a second. <laughs> but give me a second to overthink real quick. <laughs> I don't know if he was that good though. Like defense, like Big East Player of the Year, Marquette. Oh, ten seconds. I, yeah. Mar, uh, Jay Five. Crowder. Jay Crowder. Final answer. That Number babe, one. Dana. That babe, way not to overthink. I didn't realize he was that, that good, but nice. All Make right. it four to two. After transferring in following Johnny Flynn's departure, the Syracuse forward averaged over 16 points per game, eight rebounds per game, was the 2010 Big East Player of the Year. Uh, is this Wesley that guy? Johnson, That's correct. Wesley nice. Johnson, four to two. You got Titus. Get us going again. He was movies. I was going to say, anyone want a couple no. movies? Fights? Um, I think that's the same same logic with Titus. You got Ken Jack over there. So oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's save it. They're not gonna double. Here we go. This is for the ponies. Grossing over two hundred million worldwide, Brad Pitt, Shia LaBeouf, and John Bernthal starred in this two thousand fourteen American war film. Fury. Oh, uh, yes. Fury. Final answer. I like Five underrated. 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 Yeah, really underrated. underrated. Good flick. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We're, we're playing we're Here playing we go. Right now, boys. Mm-hmm. Five to three. Hey, over 150 million worldwide. Ben Affleck, Anna Kendrick, and John Bernthal started this 2016 American action. Uh, the accountant. Final answer. The accountant. Final answer. 
That is correct. Five to three going into the bonus round. Great. Anna match. Kendrick gets oh. turned on by Ben Affleck doing math in that movie. It's very funny. <laughs> <laughs> Ponies passed up on a couple doubles there that they ended up getting right. They have a two point lead going into the bonus round, and it's a fun one. Time to make the donuts. TV is the theme for the bonus round. TV. And I'll, I'll, I'll give a little. Oh, Ken Jack will like this. It's Don't specifically non-network TV, too. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Fuck the networks, dude. <laughs> Fuck those shows. They're not real. No one watches them. <laughs> uh, here we go. Either going to be five to five or seven to three ponies with still a lot of points left. Ponies up first every time. Smocking up second. Uh, you're trying to name things on a list of 30 things. If you get it right, that's one. Team with the most after five rounds gets a point. If we uh, Two points. If we don't have any winner after five rounds, we go to sudden death. Back and forth, we go about 10 seconds per guest, roughly. Here we go. Name the 30 most recent non-network ABC, CBS, NBC, Fox. Non-network TV Best Comedy Emmy nominees. So that's streaming or premium or regular cable. No NBC, no ABC, no CBS, no Fox. So last time I'll say that. Here we go. Timer begins now. Uh, uh, um, Maisel, Miss Maisel. Do what? Marvelous Miss Maisel. <laughs> Marvelous Miss Maisel. Final answer. Uh, Veep. Veep. Turb. Turb. Final answer. Turb. <laughs> Two to one. You said turd. Um, you said turd. Turd. He just didn't even say turb. close to curb. Turb bus. <laughs> Um, best comedy Barry maybe I guess they would Nine. do it they would. four three hey so what's non-network Barry, Barry. Barry yeah I'll go I'll get you not on uh, not on like ABC NBC CBS so the, the office doesn't work on no shows? the bear the bear the bear this is um, where it's hard because they're I don't know the com like what I wouldn't uh, what's the great Kinjak, what's the one where the, the girl and the priest and the um so like Apple Plus? Oh uh Fleabag. Yes. Fleabag. Ah, uh, good one. Good one right there. Three to three. Damn. I'm like Would, uh, uh, is the rest Ted of Lasso on TV. Ted Lasso. Ted, Ted yeah. Lasso. Good one. Lasso, good one. Yes. Answer. All right. Uh, the, the great. Yeah. The great. The what great. Jack said. Hey, oh, uh, no way. That about, was definitely hey, about, Jeff, I said uh, not what Ken Jackson. What about uh, the one where it's like uh like monogamy or something with Seth Rogan and five. that one chick? Uh, uh, um only murders in the building. Yeah, that one. Final answer. <laughs> that's correct. They win the bonus round. Let's go! Yeah, oh, I know that's a win. Yeah. I was thinking, uh, do you know what I'm talking about? Yes, What's very good. Atlanta, and then, uh, Kai, and then we were forgetting me. Sarah Marshall. Cobra Kai Emily and Emily in Paris. Paris got a nod, but not the great. That's bullshit. Flight attendant, girls, glow, hats, insecure, jury duty, Kaminsky method, master of none, orders the new black. Atlanta's a comedy? Hey, Schmitz Willie. Creek. Oh, that's a good Willie, one. Willie, add a boy with uh, Ted Lasso. Yeah, that's that was huge, Will. Oh, let's go. The Why fucking my Emily in Paris. Fuck that. Wednesday? I didn't know Wednesday would be one. Wednesday's pretty good. Yeah, when, uh, Wednesday is good. I'm just, I didn't know it'd be. Yeah, oh, I see what you're saying with the comedy. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah, we even. Veep we even good? Just, I've heard a lot of good things about Veep. V, oh, yeah, Veep's the even, best. Uh, Veep's, yeah, awesome. Veep's amazing. We even rechecked Ken Jack. It got nominated for everything except for series. Like acting. Ah, that's crazy. Yeah, crazy. <laughs> very strange. It, I feel like it always, every season, it gets nominated for everything. That's nuts. Uh, college football. Does any do you want to double ponies? No. Here we go. This is we for the call someone if we don't know. This boys. is for the ponies. As a senior, this pack at this Pac-10 school, Jerome Harrison was a 2005 consensus All-American after rushing for 1,900 yards and 16 touchdowns. That sounds like an Oregon player. I mean, I'm thinking Oregon or Cal, but I don't know if it's. Well, the only people who could call are Mincy or Brandon Walker, and they're not going to help us. Hey, I'm going to do a quick lap 
Jack, see if Jack Max here. See if I have time to get this in. That's before his, that's before his era, I think. <laughs> Ten seconds. You either got to commit to it. Or answer Jack five. Max. Oregon. Four. Three. Wait. No. Two. Will. Damn. Oregon. Final answer. <laughs> <laughs> Other side. I, I, I think it's either it's one of the Washington schools, but I'm not sure which. I kind of think Washington State, but I'm not totally sure. Ten seconds. Or is it Washington? I know it's one. Uh, I I okay. think Washington State. I think I'm Washington does that. Looking for Jack Mack. Right, uh, Washington State. Final answer, Jeff. Seven to four. Let's go, Missy. There we go, Missy. I've been struggling. I'm sorry, guys. Providing for you. Oh, me too. What they signed you for right there, though. Here we go. To make it Good seven job, five. Missy. It's Get still, those back. It's I still, I think, too big of a hole school. to dig out. I, know, I, screw, I screwed us that Kmart thing. Yeah. Uh, as a senior at this Big Ten school, Javon Ringer was a 2008 consensus All-American after rushing for 1637 yards and 22 touchdowns. See? Uh, Michigan State. We could, we could ask oh. Brandon. We don't need Brandon. We got men. No, it's um, Michigan State. Yeah. Oh, all right. Yeah, we don't need Brandon. Hell Michigan yeah. State, final answer. <laughs> what a Seven swing. There we go, Mincy. Oh, oh yeah. no. Did you know that one? <laughs> John. John also <laughs> did, did a mile lap that. around the office. <laughs> what the fuck just happened? I, I left up 7 3, came back 7 5. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I finally appeared this match is what happened. Um, <laughs> oh, okay, Mincy. <laughs> TV next category. TV. Does anyone want to double TV? Should we do, double this maybe? <laughs> yeah, I guess might as well. I am tired though, so that factors in. All right. Double. Okay, doubled up TV. This is for uh, – this is for the ponies for two points. They are pretty good in this category. Seventeen and two for two points to make it nine to five. After getting her start on Broadway, this actress got an Emmy nomination for her leading role as Rachel Berry on Glee. For two points. We can call someone, right? Can't you doubled it up. Fuck. Right when fights his head went down is when I got nervous. Yeah, we're dead. She can't read. Who are some Broadway actresses? I don't know. I think her name's Rachel. Five. Four. Rachel. Three. Two. One. Rachel, final answer. <laughs> it's Leah so Michelle. I, Leah Michelle. Leah Michelle. Fuck. Can't, can't read was right where I was at, too. Leah Le- Michelle, right, Kendra? Do you get two points? Yeah. Final yeah. answer. They do get two points. They tie it oh, up. Man. That's a tough swing. That's did a tough swing. Oh, yeah. I didn't know that was a rule. No, it's, yeah, doubled yeah, up, tied it. up. You, you never still want a double? I guess uh, not. Apparently not. Dude, every time up, we take the lead. playing well, it just goes bad. <laughs> it goes After so Ron bad. Saturday Night Live, this actor in Emmy nomination for leading role is Phil Miller on The Last Man on Earth. It's Will Forte, right? I never watched the show, but I think you're right. Yeah. It's Will Forte. He's the last man on Earth. you're right about that. Yeah. I never watched it either. I just remember the billboards and shit. Um, he definitely was an yeah. SNL, and I'm pretty th- I think you're right. I think you're yeah, right. Yeah, Will Forte, final answer. Five point run. They have the wow. lead. Wow! Oh shit, dude! Boy, I knew getting up and running was going to be a bad omen. I, I knew <laughs> it. Um, I thought Rachel too. By the way, fights. I don't know why I thought that. Yeah, to tie it up at eight apiece. Wow, that's not good. This two time all. All right, back in it. Back in. All star outfielder played his entire career with the Dodgers from 06 through 2017. Told 162 home runs and won a Silver Slugger and a Gold Glove. You both have call a friend. You both have double sip. Is that Matt Kemp? Didn't Kemp go to the Padres for a bit, though? Yeah, he did. Uh, Ethier? Yes. Andre Ethier? I think that yes. That sounds so right. That Andre who? Ethier. Ethier? Yeah. Andre Ethier. Andre Ethier. Final answer. We're not enough in A to P. All That's right. Correct. Uh, boy, uh, boy, Good Dana. Job, Dana. Good Thank job, boys. Good job, boys. Welcome, Yana Matt Kemp. Side. That's my guy. His one time All Star All Star third base and played his entire career with the Mariners from 2011 through 2021. Totaled 242 home runs and won a gold glove. Any ideas? If not, we can phone. I, I have a good phone a friend MLB guy we can use for sure. 
Brandon's right next to you, right, Titus? You think yeah, Brandon doesn't know this. There's no way Brandon knows this. Um, hey, Minty, you can mute it. <laughs> um, yeah, Mincy, you want to use your phone, a friend guy? Yeah, you I got, do. Uh, You're on your phone, buddy? though. Oh, yeah. Good point. Um, uh, I, should I just call, should I call Clemmer? Yeah, yeah. Call, call Clemmer. Call Clemmer. Call, call, Clemmer. Clemmer. call Chris Clemmer. Phone a friend off the board. For I need to get my phone of friends in line. Phone a friend still on the board for the ponies. Both have double sip presented by New Amsterdam Vodka. Hey. Uh, I'm on the dozen. Can you see the question? All star third baseman for his entire career. Oh, that's uh, uh, Kyle Sager. S E A G E R. Kyle Sager? Damn. Kyle Sager? Yeah, Corey's brother, right? Yeah. Because he's saying Corey's brother. Is it Sager or Seeger? Seeger. 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 Okay. Kyle Seeger. Yeah. Kyle Seeger. Kyle Seeger. Kyle Seeger. Final answer. Okay. That is correct. Nine. Eight. Thank you, Clemmer. That was nice. It like that. That was really odd. I knew that one. Fuck. He also spelled it right. That was a smart move. That's a good dozen move. Just spell it. That way you can't get it wrong. Uh, here we go. Um, hell of a match. It's turned into a hell of a match. Yeah. Uh, Bra- Brandon said he didn't know it. It's a good thing we didn't ask him. Shout out, yeah. Clemmer. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Fellas, we got to stop being a first half team. Yeah. We got to get in shape. We have to be a second half, you know. Hey, right. hey, hey. It's also, we're fourth quarter starting now. Yep. Niche yep. category time. Last four rounds. Uh, last three rounds, excuse me. Uh, <clears throat> college to the NBA for the Booze Ponies. For two points, take the lead. Despite being selected 56 overall, Ramon oh, Sessions kid? enjoyed an 11 year career and playing for what school? Nevada. 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 My Nevada. boy, Dana. That is correct. 10 to that 9. That dude had a weird face. He had a very angular face, if I remember right. Fights. Fights. What? Oh, oh. I see this is the problem with using my phone. I can't see the the uh little little things before it's up. All right, to take an eleven to ten lead, Sopranos for Smokin. Soprano. Here's the question. What is the name of Robert Patrick's character who debuts in season two and ends up owing Tony a large gambling debt? It's uh, uh the guy It's the guy who played T two. Yeah, yeah. Uh, dang, uh... Yeah, I know who it is. Hang on a second. It was uh, Eric Scatino. Eric Scatino. Right, uh, Eric Scatino, final answer. Final answer. Yeah, no, Dave, no, Davey Scatino. Davey Scatino. No, yeah. let's go! Yeah. Let's go! <laughs> Davey, right? He said Davey? Davey, I think he said Davey. Yes. Davey Scatino? Yes. Come on, Davey Mincy. Scatino, Give final answer. Give it to me, answer. Mincy. Give it to me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's good it's stuff, good fellas. <laughs> that is, I just threw my phone. I'm, I'm ashamed. I should. I hope I don't get kicked off our team for that. Titus, <laughs> Titus, you got to stop letting your team say final I'm, answer. I'm yeah. You got to clean it up in your house. <laughs> it's not Titus's fault that I, I, I knew it's, it and missed it. It's not your fault. We take the good with the bad. We take the good with the bad. We take the good with the bad. That's, that's well, there's a lot of bad. There's a lot of bad. <laughs> I mean, I just Didn't knew it. Get a final answer. I switched it right. Mincy you said did. final answer and then changed your answer in the same breath. <laughs> oh, I no, I sure look. I'm not. I'm not deflecting. I mean, I just. How, why I would just, you say final answer if you're changing the answer? His son's name. Was, his son's name was Eric in the show. I screwed it up and said the son's name. His son's name was Eric. The meadow was friends. With. It is you. Got, so you. So you said Davy. You. You almost said Davy when I asked yeah. him, and then you said, Hold "Yeah, on. I know. I screwed it up because his son was Eric, and the dad was Davy." Yeah, whatever. but it's not that. You, it's not Mitzi. It's not that you got it wrong. We all get questions wrong. That's okay. It's it's that that I gave it away. It's that, yeah, it's that that I gave final it. answer. Yeah, and then said a different answer all like in a split second. <laughs> I can't help. You said final it. answer, Davy. I, I don't know. I got nothing. I mean, I screwed it. Like, All right. we're gonna have to let's get on with life. You know? Okay, three point lead. Four points remain. Wild. Uh, 
This is for oh, oh, snacks, snacks and candy. If you get it, um, we got our phone. If you get it, the calls. match, the match is over. The match is over. We could call the big boys if we need them. <laughs> you said God, final I'm answer. I'm the worst. I'm so mad, dude. I can't. Mm-hmm. I don't know what to. I'm so upset right now. Again. Chips Deluxe is a variety of cookies marketed and sold by what brand? This is for the world. Is that pretty fun? Chips Ahoy? That's I would have said right. Chips Ahoy is exactly what I would have said. It does feel like – I don't know if that's a uh, – yeah, I think it's Not, Chips Ahoy. Wait, would it be uh, – Want me to call Clem? I it, might as well get the big guy is on the it, horn. Is it, is it who who owns Chips Ahoy though? That's that's what I was thinking. It's that, but I think it's it's a cookie, it like Nabisco? Nabisco or something. Ten seconds. I'm yeah, calling Clem. Yeah, get the big guy on the horn. Let's let's talk yeah, it out. Clem, this would lock up the win. I think. It's hey, uh, Jeff, if we phone, can we also double sip? Yeah, you can. All right, I'm calling him. I'd say, like, right now, gun to our head, Chips Ahoy and Nabisco would be the Nabisco, double set. Yeah. Would we be wrong to think that, Jeff? <laughs> no comments. <laughs> All I can tell you is you can use two life funds if you want. I'm, I'm in complete agreement, Will. Bro, we, oh my uh, God, bro, Clemmer! We might we might have the worst uh, Clemmer. Uh, Clemmer. phone a friend or even just any lifeline luck. We're, we're after the call. Let's uh, double dip Nabisco first. Thing. Yeah, we'll double sip. We'll start okay, with uh, we'll, vodka. we'll start we'll start with Nabisco. Ten seconds again. I'm scared about chips. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. Let's go, Jeff. Chips, ahoy, final answer. 20 oh. seconds. <laughs> 20 seconds. That's a bad round for Smokin. <laughs> That's a tough one. That was 0 for 3 on lifelines. That's crazy. Is it like, like oh. Keebler? <laughs> like Keebler brand? Like the, the, oh, he's the calling me five. Back. Four. The fudge one? Three. Yeah, Keebler, Jeff, final answer. 12 to 10, they're still alive. <laughs> I'm so, I'm so hey, mad hey, fights, fights. You want to know what makes me sick? After we said that, we got it wrong. I'm thinking of the characters, and I was like, what if it's like that little Keebler dude? What if it's that little elf fella? <laughs> I thought, hey, I uh, thought for it. sure we were right. This is, I was as confident as I'm still so lonely. Farmhouse is a variety Pepper's of cookies Farm. marketed and sold by what brand? You have your right. double sippers in my name, and Vok. You don't have to use it here if you don't want. Is it Pepper's Farm? If they, if you miss yeah. and they get it, it's over. But if they miss, it's you're still alive. Fuck. Pepperidge Farm. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. But this might be like the Chips Ahoy thing where like the chip is in the question, but also not the thing. It might be like a similar. Oh, my Jesus Christ. What? Is... We have our double sip, right? We have to have a team. We have to have a team meeting oh about confidence. And the, the... <laughs> like when you see a question and you immediately shoot out of the out of the gates with the answer and then walk it back. Um, Five, four. Double sip, Three. Jeff. Uh, Pepperidge Farm, first guess. Double sip presented by New Amsterdam Vodka. You used it. You didn't need it. It's Pepperidge Farm. It's 12 okay, away. Right. Wow, we're alive. No way. Hey. Fours. That's Fours. all right. Last category is release year. Oh. You're going to get a TV show, a song, and a movie. You got to release. So, you got to tell me. The order Jeff. of release, oldest oh. to newest, oldest to newest. Jeff. Oldest to newest. Jeff, walk me through the scenario here. If they get this right, they win. It's over. But if they get it wrong, we could steal and then get ours right, and then we would win. Correct. Interesting. What? Why? Okay. okay. Wow. Why is that, Jeff? If they get both, they win. Just let it yeah. play out, Willie. Don't worry. Oh, yeah, if they get if they get both, for sure. But Just if it's let tied, it, yeah, you have, be, so you have the ball in your hands, Will, but if you give it back to us, you might not get it again. We control it. Jeff, system. Jeff, we'll take the ball and go score. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, we want the ball. Oh, oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> For the win. Sort these three pieces of media by release here. Oh, no. Song, Mirrors by Justin Timberlake, TV show, Scandal, movie, Gone Girl. This, oh, I feel like it's all the same year. <laughs> It's it's not. No, no. <laughs> yeah, that, I can, spoiler. I can tell you, it's not the same. Hey, 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 somebody, somebody, sing mirrors to me. 
It's Justin Timberlake. Uh, yeah, I do like, I do. <laughs> that feels like the middle answer. Let's go. I'm thinking uh, Scandal, Mirrors, Gone Girl. That's what I'm thinking like too, that. Will. I like that a lot, Willie. Five. Four. Scandals, Mirrors, Gone Girl, final answer. That is correct. The yes! <laughs> Let's go. Congrats. Congrats to y'all. I blew this match, and I'm just going to like Other side, it. All of Me by John Legend, Mr. Robot 22 Jump Street. Uh, That's... I believe all of them. it's Mr. Robot all of me jump street, I think. Uh, Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> I usually say points matter, but for a team that's gonna make the tournament already, not really. Um let's go sure, do, oh, Mr. Think Ro- Mr. Mr. Robot, Mr. 22 Jump Street, all of me, final answer. Other side formality. We took the ball and we scored. We did. I would go I, I, I would go. I guess Robot All of Me Jump Street. Sure. Really? I was thinking Jump Street. Five. All of Me Robot. But that's Three. 21, I think you're thinking of. Two. Oh, One. yeah. Say yours. What's Fight said? Final answer. Nah, neither, neither you got it. All of Me Jump Street, uh, Mr. Robot. Damn. All right. Fuck it. Two point, another two point match for Spock. And, uh, I mean, we the winners, but, but Titus, the mint, I mean, yeah, team yeah, meeting? we right. listen, Jeff. We win as a team, we lose as a team. You could go back right. through and and point out individual moments where um, it, it it went horribly wrong. Um, really, just one moment. Um, <laughs> but it's a team game. Team game. Uh, I don't want to put all the blame on Mincy, but if Mincy wants to put all the blame on himself, I will gladly allow him to do that. Uh, go ahead. I, I'm, I'm going to put all the blame on myself because I didn't okay. just screw us on the Sopranos thing. I talked to you out of Kenyon Martin on that first one. So I oh, I for, you know what's crazy? Us. I forgot about that. You see, that <laughs> is I directly <laughs> tossed us <directly, laughs> three points. Look. And the fact is, I said final answer. I named some done. So, I mean, look, I got to say, I never do at Barstool is apologize <laughs> for my mistake. Look, look, right, let me say this. This is what I mean. We take the good with the bad. That, that was bad. That was horrible. We lost the game. But that clip is going to go viral and all that shit. And True. then we get more fan vote. And then we get higher spots yeah. in the tournament. So it's good. Right. I mean, we call bad. that. We, we call never that, pass our fan vote. That's called the ponies method. You you, you lose entertainingly, and people like it. It's uh, foolproof. Exactly. Well, I, I, Jeff, the Mints method is screwing up and going viral. It's an art that, form. Titus, what you just said after that is the uh, almost word for word what Coley said after Mincy did this in the second tournament a couple years ago. <laughs> Look, we win as a team, lose a team. I don't want to blame anyone. However, <laughs> however, <laughs> Giovanni Bernard, Greg <laughs> Little, and TJ it. Yates all attended what ACC school? The University of No. Uh, let's go to University of North Carolina, I guess. Is that what he's about what to What else would it be? No, I don't know. <laughs> Greg Little to Wait, North nothing, something. What else is after? The there's ACC? only, there's only North, North Carolina, Carolina and North Carolina. Unless he's fucking with us. UNC. We'll go to North Carolina. Unreal giveaway by Mintz. <laughs> he gave away a free point. Honkers, other Mint. side. Up and down, even one. massive little Coley thoughts. You know, Jeff, you never want to blame one. No, you one can't. <laughs> <laughs> also, how many times did Mincy try to give them the answer before he realized uh, that we're like two or three times in the start? Um, uh, if I was pointing <laughs> fingers, I would point that stuff out, but I'm not. So um, I, I got nothing, Titus. I mean, I screwed up. You know, tough one. We'll, 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 we'll clean it up. One, two, and one. Ponies three, two, and zero oh now. Um, <laughs> ironically, uh, you, say you screwed up with the Quran across the board. Right? Pretty even match in terms of who got points from the team, too. What a match. Uh, last week, a bunch of blowouts. Yeah, this week, we start off with the Clash. Um, shout out to Blue. Um, two, uh, two high fan vote teams. Two teams that you'll see in June in the tournament. That's it. Thank you, Nancy and Vodka. Thank you for watching. Uh, we'll talk to you uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow.